The prolonged drought has affected lives of human and livestock in the rural area of Harfo in Mudug region of Puntland. Several families have lost their animals, while the rest of families remain view animals. Dead body of our animal is in everywhere in the bush. You come see and just follow me. I lost 500 heads of gouts and this is the dead body of the last one. I become bankrupt. This drought has come when the expected rain season postponed since the last two seasons and become dry the water storage in the villages. People are mostly demand to the water storage. This is the cause to abandon and push people from their original locations and to move on where they assume to survive and getting aid support. People affected by the droughts have abandoned to other locations nearby the towns, far from their original locations, despite they do not receive enough aid, and they fabricated small huts to live. Emergency drought response began to provide assistance to the needed people affected by the drought. Aid received by the drought affected people are not enough to cover their lives and home. People abandoned from the drought and traveled long distance were asked their situation in any assistance need. They responded the drought affected us seriously and we lost our animal. SAMO Development Organization, SDO, which is Somali local NGO, and getting support from its partners, Forum Sid, has carried out drought response project to Harfo Mudug region to assist hundreds of families abandoned from different locations and delivered 380 plastic shelters for protection, 1,000 blankets, and 600 non-food items. SDO has also delivered cash for work program for removing the sands from seven blocked roads in order to make easy the access of transportation to the villages. SDO rehabilitated 37 broken water storage. After the distribution of the shelters and non-food items, NFI, people started to build small huts to live. Several mothers who received a support from SDO had thanked them from the assistance given them. Of course we are here due to the drought effect. We abandoned from push and lost our animal due to the famines. Life is difficult. We will use the received blankets and plastic shelter as protection from the sunlight and the waves from the wind when we thank to those who deliver us. This is the first humanitarian organization supported us since our arrival in this camp. Our needs are countless. 
We need shelter protection, food and water, as well as various humanitarian support. SDO has carried out a lot of efforts, including the rehabilitation of the water storage of the hosted villages. The water storage in the villages were broken due to lack of rain since the last two seasons, and this is the most concern raised by the villagers who are hosting the abandoned people from other areas. Several water storage were rehabilitated in order to save enough amount of water from the next season of rain and the rehabilitated water storage can be useful over one decade. The local district administration of Harfo show how they are happy to the emergency drought response from SDO Forum Sid and seems people are getting recovery from the difficult situation of the drought after receiving aid support from SDO and Forum Sid. In Baragua, I will watch it from now then. In Baraga, Badan, or Tirabadan, Bahadalakawai. The water storage was broken and it could not be possible to use without rehabilitation made by SDO. But now it is rehabilitated and I hope it is saving the water. This is the first humanitarian organization rehabilitated the water storage become dry and broken due to the prolonged droughts. The mayor of Harfo district welcomed the drought response that caused loss of several animals and displacement of many families. On behalf of the local district administration and the community of Harfo district, we gratitude to STO and Forum SID for the delivery of the humanitarian support. The drought affected people were the most beneficiaries of the aid in relevant time of need. The project was covered rehabilitation of the water storage to survive them and their animals. The community will be able to save enough water in the next raining. Humanitarian response and support provided by STO, including the blankets and plastic shelters people were used as protection from the sunlight and wind. Therefore, I could say this is a visible and I thank them their kind support. Seven months later, rain has come and affected all the drought pretentious areas. The rain has been enjoyed all the people and their animals. The empty water storage has been filled by the rain. People and their animals are mostly dependent to the water storage. The rehabilitated water storage has received and saved a lot of water from the rain, which can be consumed by the people and the animal in the long time. Rights reserved by SAMO Development Organization, SDO.